let's talk about a game called Silver Surfer. Most people know about it because of the nerd. That's perfect. That's perfect. Giving all credit to him. I want to get that out of the way. But even with that fact, there's something that's been bugging me. I'm not going to trash on Silver Surfer. I don't even know that much about the character, except for the fact that he works for Galactus. That, that's the only thing I know as far as story plot and origins with him. That, that's all I know. That's all I know. So I have no reason to critique it. But I will admit that Fantastic Four would be around now. So, different story. Anyways, there's one thing that has been bugging me. One really bad thing. Well, not so much. One of my friends, they just went and asked me, like, oh, they saw my radius video, and they're like, oh, cool, man, that's that's awesome, you're making a video, but why did he say that Silver Surfer was kind of like radius, what, are you saying radius sucks, or something like, oh, dude, I mean, you're like, what's wrong with Silver Surfer? So many things, it's too many. Now, I actually got the chance to play it. I tried it. Because you know, maybe the nerd was probably over exaggerating a little bit. Maybe just a little bit. Maybe just a little bit. Telling the freaking truth. Ah, you just look at the title screen. Look at that. That's actually pretty damn good. What gives the indication that this game is going to be bad? Hell, it even has a cool cutscene. What I mean, cool? I mean, it was cool for its time. I mean, look at it. That's pretty damn detailed. Eh, nothing really to complain about right there. So you get a selection about five stages, which is, eh, alright, I mean, I was kind of expecting more, but I guess it's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Well, the graphics look okay, I mean, the background is mainly just a bleak, empty blackness, so, you know what, but everything else seems to be alright. Nothing special, it's just your normal 2D shooter, so, I can't really complain about that. Well, let's see, I just go up here, and let's see where it goes, okay? Yeah, this guy's kind of taking a couple more hits, and you- What, what the hell? How did- uh, I just died, that's it? Are you sh You gotta be crapping me! Okay, okay, me okay, I shouldn't have gone that way. I'll go- I'll go a different route this time. Okay, finally got a power-up, so let's see how far I can get with this thing. Okay, that was too close for comfort. Okay, turn around, turn around, shoot the other way! Uh, gosh! What the flying fudge nuts, man? I didn't- I had him! I shot him 50 freaking times! How the hell did I die? Okay, that was complete utter bullcrap, but let me see here. Let me just try a different stage. Maybe if I calm myself down with some easier stage, maybe that might solve it. I mean, maybe I just picked the hardest one. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. The ghosts, the, the ghosts, they, they broke me. They, they freaking broke me. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, I can't even hit the stupid things because they're moving in such a regular pattern. Every time I just try to get close to them, they just go... And I Hi. This game cheats. Okay, this is horse crap. I'm getting slightly farther, but it doesn't make a difference. Every time I try to go at least somewhat close, at least somewhat farther than I could, I just end up dying either way. There's almost no point, because I keep on just... I'm just literally just staying in this one section right here. Oh, yay! Hey, this stage has an overhead view. This does not look awkward at all. Well, I'll be honest, it's not that bad, but... After watching the nerd's video, you'll probably understand what I mean. Well, the bright side is I'm making it farther than I did the last stages, so I can at least say this is okay. But just for that reason. Uh, nothing really gameplay-wise, just that I'm not losing my head. Wait, what's that? 
What's that? What's that? Was that a checkpoint? What was was that a freaking checkpoint? Was that a checkpoint? Oh my goodness! That was a checkpoint. Hmm. I'm sort of having a hypothesis right now. I really do. This game for this stage only, because this game is a piece of crap. Oh, you know what? No, it's not a piece of crap, because you know a piece of crap would probably be fair. This game is not fair. It is not giving me my fair treatment as a gamer. I mean, criminy. I didn't even get farther in the stage than I have with all the others I've been through. Really? If I really was to calculate how far I got in this one, it wouldn't really come up any higher than all the rest, so... I guess with overhead views, they know it's gonna suck, so they know they have to give you some leniency. Thank you. Thank you very much. I'm sorry, game? Did... Did you just throw an impossible... Popsicle in my face? I mean, let's let's take a look at this. Let's take a look at this. How the hell is a normal human being supposed to be able to dodge that? Especially in the first time. That is going way too fast. Way too fast. And there's not enough room. Especially with freaking Silver Surfer's longboard. Most fair stage I've played so far, and then they just decided to kick it out the window by putting this. Bravo, guys. Bravo. Bravo. And if you think there's really any motivation to keep me going, there's not. There's not. I just played the only decent stage there left. You wanna know what the other ones are? There's one stage that reminds me of Gradius, except way too unforgiving. I mean, criminy. I can't even get past the first inch the first inch the other stage is just another overhead shooter and you think since i beat at least gotten farther with that one than all the others i would at least think this one is okay too but no this one is 10 times worse there are borders up the wazoo i can't even move i can't even move without dying without getting hit by these stupid just i i i i i I can't stop dying in this, Now I'm really trying. With Gradius, it always felt like it's my fault, which makes me still want to continue. This game is just being unfair, just kicks you in the shin, laughs in your face, and just drinks a smoothie. You wanna know why I hate this game? The game is too difficult, but for the wrong reasons. Again, wrong reasons for being difficult. It is the trademark of a bad game. There's not much to really say about controls, all you do is just shoot. Simple as that. And how the heck can you just decide to screw it up and throw it out the window is beyond me. Crap! God damn it. Oh, fudge me. Oh, flip it, habit. Nanky Doodle had a farm and he shot his goddamn horse! I tried my best. I honestly did try my best. But you know what? I just can't do it. You know what? Try to do something like this, but you know I should have just went and stuck what I was about to do. I should have just went with Pokemon Stadium 2. I'm honestly pissed at this game. I don't want to look at it. It's frustrating. I nearly threw my controller all the times I even tried playing the game. So you know what? Just screw it. I'll go back to doing Pokemon Stadium 2 like I intended to, and maybe I can rest up a bit from that. All right. Alpha Breaker 1. Have a good day.